Hi guys, nice to see you again and thank you for watching Cooking with an Italian. Today again, charcuterie, because a lot of you ask for new stuff uh, I'm ready to do. Today we're going to make uh, a nice salami. It's typical from South Italy, precise, uh, well, in South Italy is very common, called punta di salame or salsiccia punta di coltello. It's cut everything by knife. Uh, nothing is uh, meat. First step uh, is cut the meat. For the, I, I, this is a kilo, it's uh, 700 grams loin of pork, completely lean, even this grizzly and now take it off, okay? 300 grams of uh, belly pork without skin, okay? First thing to do is cut it. Take a nice sharp knife and uh, make strip like that and you have to cut it like that, cubes like that, even a little bit less. You can, you need uh, time to do this, like this, and uh, chop like that, this dimension, okay? Easy, nice, you can have your, take your time, okay. Cut all this meat, put in the bowl, and put in the bowl. And uh, when it's, uh, everything is cut, I show you the second step, okay? See you soon. Okay, guys, the meat is ready cut. We have stuff, something like this, easy. Now, we need a skin. I have the large one because I want to make properly salami, you know? You see, it's, it's large one. I don't gonna use any because uh, this one I gonna top it up by spoon. Okay, for this uh, salami, we need, uh, the main thing is this, is uh, red pepper puree, it's spicy, this is delicious, I make. Next time I'm gonna show you the, how do you make this sauce. We need 30 grams of sea salt, peppercorn, just uh, 10 of them, and uh, a teaspoon of black pepper. We need string and one of these. Okay? Wow. Come on. Here we go. The salt inside, please. Yeah. Everything. Pepper. Peppercorn. Thank you very much. And now, we start mix by hands. Okay? Quite nice. Just like this. Now, we put this pepper. Red pepper. This is a typical from Calabria. It's South Italy. It's a beautiful region. It's one the beautiful in Italy. Okay guys, and now mix everything. You're gonna mix this at least 20 minutes, okay? See you in uh, 20 minutes, okay guys? After 20 minutes, very nice massage day, the time. Look, it's beautiful and the smell is already super. Now it's time to put in the skin. In the skin here, I just, I, I wash it just with water and a teaspoon of vinegar. Just to be clear. Now we start doing it. This is very large. You see? You can use any dimensions you like. This one I'm gonna try to put inside by by ends. Maybe by ends is, is even better. Like this. Okay? Take your time, put everything inside. When you this uh, you do this uh, stuff, charcuterie stuff, never never you gonna be rush. Because this stuff need time. Okay? Well, guys, put all the meat inside and uh, later I show you the next step. I'll, I'll put some string around and the how we finish this salami. Okay? See you soon. Okay, guys, the salami is kilo. In the skin is like that. Now, the next thing we have to do to put some string. Okay? Important. We very strong. We do this. Very strong. Throw the spicy, okay? Take it out. Here you can make hole because we're gonna hang it. Like this, perfetto. This you can cut here, here. Now, we're going to do, from here I do two salami, more or less. I can make three, but it's too short. We make two salami, more or less, half kilo each. And this gonna, we're gonna hang in 48 hours, room temperature. And later, gonna be in the fridge, at least, two months. When you do this, cut here, 
take it off. Like this we don't put in the bin, eh? We do some ragu, some pasta, everything. You do again here. Try to do this very well. Okay, guys, the two salami, they're gonna be in this uh, like that. Now, the very important is we took the, the stick and you know the all hair here, just try to pop it. You know, already come out the, the sauce. Pop it everywhere. It's beautiful. Look at Pop it everything. And guys, this two salami, when you finish it, room temperature for 48 hours. Put some tray underneath because it's gonna leak a little bit, okay? See you in 48 hours. 48 hours gone. Nice, dry, already. The smell is already nice. Now this going in the fridge, this is a little bit thick and the meat we cut is not means we chop it. At least it's gonna be two months, two, two and a half months, okay? We try to find always the space where you're gonna put it. Here, my fridge, you know, we have guanciale, gonna be ready. I put here this one, you know, and I leave it there. Here, I have the mutton or leg, <laughs> so a lot of stuff going on. Okay, see you in uh, two, two and a half months, okay? Two and a half months gone. The salami is completely changed, lost over 50%. It's beautiful. The moldy smell, oh wow. The smell, guys, is something absolutely stunning. Uh, guys, as always, uh, if, uh, if you like this video, share with friends, subscribe to the channel, Check our website cookwithanitalian.com Now, you know what we're doing? We're going to try it. It's the best Italian style. We need just some bread and that's it. We check it. Oh, look there. Wow, beautiful. Guys, the smell is uh, something already. Wow. I have to do this now. Oh, wow. You know the meat? The joint? We cut all that meat, look, it's everything compact. Now, skin off. Okay, guys. Ooh, spicy. Mmm, guys, solid. But you cannot, I'm sorry, you cannot try it. Oh, wow. I'm proud of, of myself. Well done, Piero. Absolutely delicious. E un capolavoro. E un capolavoro. Guys, the salami with red pepper puree, spicy. Is this delicious, wow. If you like, finger up and follow us. Ciao. Finger up and follow us. <laughs>